Hi, Dr. Andrew and Dr. Amali. I'm Jane, the presenter today for the topic of software design document. And uh, this presentation, I'm going to talk about uh, introduction, the purpose of SDD, the system overview which make up of two parts, hardware and software components, the system architecture and components design, the data structure design, the design details which is uh, contain class diagrams, state diagrams, and interaction diagrams, the human interface design, and the results estimated, and lastly is the conclusion. First of all, I will talk about the function of SDD. It serves as a guide to the design of the entire software system for the Mesa Mapping robot. It provides an explanation of the software system behind the robot and its functions, and it in intended readers are the systems developers in Mesa Map robot project. The full system will contain the hardware component, which is all the physical components which the robot is made from, and a software component designed for the operators, which contains controller to control the robot to make the robot can communicate with the operator, as well as display appropriate mapping information from the robot to the operators. As I mentioned before, hardware components uh, actually it will contain the Lego mouse Mindstorm EV3 car set and sensors. In this project, we have made use of EV3 ultrasonic sensors and EV3 color sensors. The software component contains robot software subcomponent, which is the OS and API, and the operator software subcomponent, which is the Mesa mapping program. Next is a system architectures and components design. In this section, there will be architectures description, robot subcomponent and the operator control subcomponents connect to each other by Bluetooth, and component decomposition description, the robot subsystem, robot hardware component, robot control component, and the operator control subsystem. There will also be details component design description of the two systems mentioned above, which is the robot subsystem and the operator control subsystem, and the design rationale of the system architecture and the trade off. Regarding the data structure design, the section will, de will, describe, will describe about the document type definition, which is the DTD of the map. We also make use of those definitions to build the data structure for the system. The format of the file needs to be strictly adhered, and any undefined ele elements, text, attributes, keys, or values shall be rejected by the system. Example could be uh, all the points must be represented by the X and Y coordinate in string format. Robot status need to contain current degree and current coordinates. Maps will need to be stored in Mesa map formats. About the design details, we will explain about the three types of diagrams, class diagrams, which is the representations of the system classes, state diagrams, the representations of the states that reflect all the major requirements documented, and the interaction diagrams, sequence diagrams will show the interaction between the operator, the user interface, and the EV3 robot. For class diagram, there are overview class diagram, which is the class diagram of the whole systems. There will be also main class diagrams, which contains the main class where the program starts off. And the GUI class diagram contains all the components class of UI. And the robot class diagram will contain the controller class to robot, and it will also call the ledger's API. For state diagrams, there are states in auto mode and manual mode. And lastly, interaction diagrams which has loading of map, establishing of Bluetooth connection, and the movement of robot. SDD will also provide UI design introduction. And our interface will have a save map file and load map file function, automatic and manual control to the robot. Manual control, there will be go forward, go backward, turn left and turn right. There will also be back to base function and set no-go zone, 
autopilot can be turned on and off to start exploring the map and go to point function and immediate stop function to stop the robot anytime. There will also be status display panel to display all the current robot status and the current robot's location on the map as well as the robot battery level display. Resource estimated part will contain hardware interface, connection user sign requirements, robot sign requirements, and a software interface, the latest EV3 0.9.0 beta, Apache Ant version 1.8.2 and JUnit 4.10. In conclusion, SDD established a goal for the software development team to, to achieve when doing the development, and it is critical to have a detailed and well-written SDD to set a direction for the whole software development team to follow. Thank you.